The Chamber of Industry and Commerce is making it clear that it does not support the call by the Public Services Association for any further shutdown or day of rest for the public service as a mark of protest against the formation of the Trinidad and Tobago Revenue Authority. In a statement one day after PSA President Watson Duke claimed the union's call for a day of rest and reflection was a major success, the country's leading business group says it is concerned about the industrial action. According to the Chamber, the industrial action being taken may not be necessary. Its statement says, while it appreciates that uncertainty of change will always be of deep apprehension to affected employees, it believes the Minister of Finance has sought to address such anxiety in a logical and prudent fashion, all for the common good. The Chamber also believes that the possibility of any shutdown in the public service is also cause for serious national concern, given that the country recorded low productivity from Christmas to Carnival and businesses are now beginning to come to terms with a fallout from the global financial crisis. The Chamber adds that Customs and Excise and the Board of Inland Revenue are two important agencies for trade and business in this country, and it says the business community cannot function properly without the two operating fully, and a day's loss of business has serious consequences for all. The business group is reminding citizens of the country's watchwords of discipline, production and tolerance. Just recently, the Employers Consultative Association condemned the industrial action being taken by the PSA. For CNC3, I'm Melissa Williams.